Juneteenth, Emancipation Day, Freedom Day, a day to celebrate the progress of the African-American community and remember its struggles past and present. The final 250,000 people still being held as slaves finding out on this day 155 years ago that they were free. A Union Army general reading the order from this balcony in Galveston, Texas. Essentially, uh, slavery ended on that day. Uh, he was able to declare the new freed slaves, defining them as having absolute equality. The news finally arriving in Galveston more than two years after President Abraham Lincoln issued the Emancipation Proclamation. There are stories of people dancing in the streets, and from that moment forward, that would have been June 19th, 1865. The following year, there are celebrations documented as early as 1867. Juneteenth celebration. The food, the parades, the dancing continues a century and a half later. Juneteenth is recognized by 47 states in Washington, D.C. But this year, Juneteenth is celebrated with reinvigorated passion and purpose. Marches are planned for Atlanta, D.C., and Baton Rouge. In Los Angeles, the Juneteenth celebration this afternoon will work to register people to vote and highlight black businesses. As support grows for officially recognizing Juneteenth from New York. Recognizing Juneteenth as a holiday for state employees, and I'm going to propose legislation next year to make it an official state holiday. To Capitol Hill. Senator John Cornyn of Texas announcing Thursday he's introducing a bill to make it a federal holiday.